Good morning world from Camigan Island, Southern Philippines. It is Tuesday the 14th and it looks like we got a little low pressure but we got a typhoon blowing in over northern Mindanao heading our way. Should be here Thursday and they were just going to start the ferry service on tomorrow and I doubt they will allow it. They'll put a typhoon warning on it. Got the outriggers on my boat. You can't see very well because it's still pretty early. But I don't think I'll be taking my boat out anytime often. So find out. I'm sure they're going to hold, but it'll be interesting to see if they don't exactly what's going to take them out. So even though it's nasty out, I'm jumping on my bike and go checking on my babies here. I need to know what they can take before I go to the hole one day. I'll be back to town for a 6 a.m. boom jack. This is what happens when we get some heavy rain. I'd really like to see the kaboom performing in this and see if I need to make any modifications. I don't think it would break, but it might put flop around a little bit. We'll see. I'll be back heading down to check on the booms. It's still Tuesday the 14th of December 2021. This is the Crusty Goon Kaboom Canal. You can see them all the way down there fairly calm. I think the brunt of it's already gone through. This is the one that comes right by the Kaboom shop, so we're going to loop around and check on Krusty and see how full he got. He was already full yesterday, but hard to tell with that weather blowing in. It might have pushed it back up in the canal a bit. We'll find out. And we're in front of Krusty Kaboom. Still looks pretty good here. We've got Tropical Typhoon Rai. Rai? RAI coming in. We'll be here in two days. This is still looking pretty good. We're getting the muddy water thing going. That's what happens. We got so much construction here on the island. There's half the island's washing down. And we got a pretty good harvest here to clean out. But the amount of bottles we're getting lately is outrageous. They're like finally breaking loose up there. We're getting enough rain. All these have been hanging up there for who knows how long. There's a couple. Kaboom bottles we can use there too, two or three of them. Anyway, we'll down, go down and check on the Coke Canal, see what's happening. It's Tuesday, the 14th of December, 2021. We got a typhoon blowing this way. This is our highest flow canal. This will be like a water rapid, so we're going to clean this one out. I wanted to do it today, but my employee's not available. So I'll probably get it in the morning, and hopefully they'll all still be here. But I went ahead and installed the safety line. This is just one strand, just in case we get hit pretty hard. She'll just snap loose, and then she'll lay over on the side over there by the sandbank until we can put her back. So let's empty it out and see if she survives this typhoon. I probably could have just hooked it up direct, but the way it's looking, I think it would have pulled the anchor out of the concrete, and who knows what damage it would do to the top here. So we'll put a safety link in just to be safe. That's what a safety link's for. Look at that beach over there. One bottle, and more than likely that was probably from a kid. It's high and dry. No bottles or garbage on that at all. Let's go take a picture. And my video editor, Chris, says, just keep it rolling. You need the program material. You can always edit out what you don't want. And after I've been editing, he's right, you know. It's a lot of times where I stop talking or something and something happened or I wanted to get some more footage on. I can edit this short or long, speed it up, whatever I want. So just look at that. That used to be like totally covered in plastic. Now there's one, two little pieces of that. Kid's got a wonderful area to play in. Even out here, it's not too bad. This is the beach I had the youngsters clean. We got a little wash up, but not as bad as it was. Weather's calmed down a little bit, but it's coming. Today's only Tuesday, so tomorrow's Wednesday. Thursday's it's supposed to hit us about then, so we'll see. But we never really get hit hard by the typhoon. We're lucky. We're always on the outskirt of it, so and then we'll take a quick tour up here of Krusty. 
It's going to be cleaned out in the morning. We'll probably bring the drop net down and round it up and drop it and quick release it. Got a nice concrete anchor on the other side and it's not flaking around like this one. This one here is kind of crumbly. Concrete mix in this country is about as weak as it is. They water it down at least half. So, so who wants to take bets on what will go first? Will the anchor pull out or will the little one strand of nylon line snap? Now, Krusty is made with four of these strands between each tire, so they're not going to go. This is going to go first. That's the plan, anyway. What do you guys think?